All right, Tony Pan again from behind the handlebars with Hupin Abraham at Quaker Steak for the Ron Boylan 13th Annual Safe Harbor Ride. I'm here with Sheriff Dave Mahoney from Dane County. And um, Sheriff's been a good friend of the motorcyclists for years. He's done some public service announcements with us about motorcycle awareness. He showed up in Madison a couple of years ago for a giant uh, awareness ride uh, from uh, bikers from all over the state that you know, came to Madison for a rally, but today he's he's working on this as he always does on this uh, Ron Borland ride. Uh, Sheriff, tell us a little about the ride and, and who, what agencies are helping and assisting. Anything you can about the ride today? Great. Well, Pan, it's great to see you. And you know, as always, I thank you and Abraham for everything they do to bring awareness to bikers on the road and our equal right to the road, just as everybody else. Hupi has always been there to support bikers, and I greatly appreciate that as Dane County we Sheriff. We appreciate you. You know, today we're going to be celebrating again uh, a ride commemorating a great man, Ron Boylan, who is the Chief Deputy of the Dane County Sheriff's Office, died of cancer in office. But one of his true commitments and the commitment of all law enforcement in this region of the state is Safe Harbor, a child advocacy center. Today we're going we're gonna to do about a 100-mile ride uh, throughout southwestern Dane County. We're going to stop over at the Mount Horb Fire Department for a little water and ice cream later today. But, it, you know, these uh, law enforcement officers that come out to lead this ride enjoy this, one, because it benefits Safe Harbor, but two, because it's, it's one of the most scenic areas of, of uh, our region. And we usually get anywhere from 100 to 300 bikes come out and enjoying this great, uh, this great sport that we call biking. That's great, and the Sheriff's Department in Dane County has always been supportive of motorcyclists. I remember working with you years ago when I was Tommy Thompson's head road captain yeah. for his governor's <laughs> rise, and you were out there blocking traffic for us back. That was back in the early 90s. Well, you know, I talked to Tommy not, not two weeks ago, and uh, we stay in contact. He's a great, great guy yep. and uh, a great motorcyclist, too, and he understands the joy of getting out on a bike, freeing your mind, and having that ability to enjoy our great state on two wheels. Well, are we going to have police assistance throughout the ride? Sure. This is a fully escorted ride, so there's no stop signs, no stop lights. We just follow the direction of the uh, uh, three or four different police departments. I think we got a dozen bikes out today from law enforcement who will be leading this ride, preventing us from having to get bogged up. But we just keep the pace that they set, and we'll have a safe ride. Well, great. We, re we appreciate everything that Dane County Sheriff does for us and for the motorcyclists, and this is a great cause. Yippee and Abraham is ha more than happy to be part of this. We've been a part of it for a number of years, and uh, let's look forward to a great ride. No rain, uh, I hope so. no fog. I had some big fog this morning, but we're going to have a beautiful day today. Thanks again, great. Sheriff. Well, we, we love riding for, uh, for law enforcement, for, uh, for good causes, for our veterans and our police officers, our deputy sheriffs and troopers. I uh, love coming out to support bikers as well. Thank you. It's Tony Pan behind the handlebars, Hupin Abraham.